Hey y'all, welcome back to Mom Before Life. My name is Trina and today it is Monday, honey. It feels it <laughs> feels just like a Monday, okay? Um, we are running all behind today. I was blessed to have Uncle Marcus let me use his car today. Uh, bad move on his part, okay? Because he ended up being late to work. I feel awful, very, very awful, y'all. I hate when somebody is helping me out and then they end up, you know, what's that saying? No good deed goes unpunished. Like, I, I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that a lot because usually Uncle Marcus is the one who does help me. So, the least I could have done was be on time so that he could go to work on time. But right now, I got to get my baby boy to school. I told him, baby, we late, so we might as well go ahead and just go ahead and eat your breakfast. Just go ahead and eat your breakfast. Let me see, baby. Y'all, you see the after little effect on my baby's eye? I'm about to go put a band-aid on it. I got these from the Dollar Tree. They're supposed to be this color of your skin. I really like these. I got one in this color for my biracial children. And then I got one in a brown tone for me and my oldest son. I'm gonna get that next. Yeah, so it's not that late to school. I hate when the kids are tardy. This is our safe zone. Let me see how long this is which in hindsight is really good because you know this year is almost over we had one tardy in the beginning of the year y'all i am instacarting right now and it has gotten super slow so i'm gonna run over to the car wash and clean out vacuum my brother's car a little bit throw some stuff away some trash away i do have my niece who with me right now so she is chilling y'all she right, so this is his car nothing super crazy got stuff on the floor see all of that and there's some stuff in the back i'm gonna go ahead and hit that get that stuff up back in the seats out my kids were in the car last night and it took them all uh, 15 seconds to get some sugar from some doggone sour straws on the seat so got uncle marcus say hey uncle marcus that's so nice y'all at least he's starting to speak okay we get <laughs> we getting some growth okay because y'all don't know uncle why is normally real nasty <laughs> it's been a long day it's been a monday um we're about to go into kroger the teenager gave me a list y'all let me tell y'all this okay the teenager i feel like the i feel like the more you get intelligent like like take honors classes and do things that are like above average it's like the common sense kind of leaves a little bit okay and it's nothing wrong with it at all but i do feel like the formulas and everything else they have to remember to do all these complex things and all of that it's like that takes front seat and it's like basic common knowledge common sense goes goes to the back so i took the teenager told me the teenager told me last night that he wants to go back to being a vegetarian so i'm like cool that's fine you know just let me know what you need so um he makes a list and he tried to give it to me while i was in the bathroom he's like you know hey you know what, what you want for the list i said go ahead put it on the refrigerator now with that statement let me know where would you put that on like if i if somebody tell you go put something on the refrigerator where would you put it so fast forward to today right I go to the refrigerator, I'm getting ready to leave. Like, I'm getting ready to go get my niece, go Instagram and stuff. And I'm looking at the refrigerator, I don't see it. Like, I can't find the paper. And so I do see a brown list up there, but it's a list that I made. And it's like stuff that it had nothing to do with him. So when I go and pick him up from school today, I'm like, hey, what happens to your list? I thought I told you to put it on the refrigerator. This boy said I did. I put it on the top of the refrigerator. <laughs> Sir, when I said put it on the refrigerator, your mind said put it on the top. First of all, <laughs> what? Okay. I'm just like, okay. <laughs> I can say that. I was just like, all right, baby. It's okay. I said, from here on out, honey, if I say put something on the refrigerator, baby, it mean get a magnet and put it on the front of the refrigerator, not literally on the refrigerator. <laughs> but look, I just got an order. Um, this is my first only shop order I've ever gotten for uh, Kroger, y'all. And it's real good, okay? Which I need because they was really wasting my time today. But it's $17. And I want to say it's only like six items. 
so that's good and i don't have to deliver plus i'm gonna grab the stuff from his little list and um we're gonna make tacos tonight so i'm gonna grab that as well but yeah let's go ahead and get up in here we're gonna go ahead and head to the front and check out because i'm done in four minutes Give her some stuff. We're gonna have some tacos tonight. So I'm gonna grab this stuff that teenager asked for. Yeah, look at me with a little list. Yeah, I already got apples from Publix. I got a 50% off. Yeah, I need bananas, spinach, cucumbers, carrots, onion. Okay, I'm gonna probably grab him some uh, potatoes as well. No, come on. Ooh. That probably be good to like have with some noodles. Yeah, that would be good. Some noodles. Yeah. So let me grab that for him. He said some carrots. I'm gonna grab a whole bag of carrots. Oh, these are like five dollars. Ew. Yeah. Uh, uh, if I'm complaining about the four ninety nine, I'm sure gonna complain about the five seventy nine. Let me see. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. And they're not ugly or beat up either. You wanna move your bread real quick? Let me see. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Don't scratch me. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, you definitely do, brother. Alright, let me grab him some potatoes. Oh, child. Look at that about to trip me up. Okay, put that off. I like the gold potatoes. A 10 pound bag, $7.79. I'm gonna grab this one. And then what's on that list as well? Let me see. Potatoes ain't on there. No, I'm gonna grab the potatoes for him because he asked for uh, onion. I don't know why he asked for onion. But we're gonna grab it. Some yellow onions. <laughs> I sure hope he doesn't. I hope he's not one of those vegans. It's just me. Oh, no. The ones that are um, clearance. Oh, Ooh, that's a baby spring mix. Okay. Right? I'm gonna grab it. Emma, where did they get it from, though? That's what I'm trying to see. Oh, right here. Yeah, I'm gonna grab what he asked for. That's three dollars for. Let me see. That's three dollars for five ounces. And then I might get the bag because this is four. Four for eight ounces. I'm gonna go with this one. Hopefully they don't mm. hand out a um, you know, them things that they be. Ooh, hold on now. Four dollars and eighty cents. That look good. But then it has no meat in it. Oh gosh. I'm gonna sit that down. That's ten dollars. Ooh. Child, what is they gonna do with them little bit of beans? You see that? That's just enough, honey. Just to get a taste. <laughs> oh, this right here, romaine lettuce. Oh, that look beat up though. This one doesn't though. I can grab that for him. Okay. I'm not gonna grab a whole bunch because I don't need any of this stuff going bad. All right, uh, brother, you mind grabbing a bag and getting him the cucumber? And then I'll go get the. Let me Grab see. A bag of cucumbers. Yeah, he, he wants uh, get him two cucumbers, um, and I'll go grab the blueberries and bananas. That looks good. Oh, I'm not gonna get it right now. I still wanted to grab this one right here, but this one looks brown. That looks brown, don't it? Yeah. And this one is the regular one. That's what I want. Yeah. Uh, probably not, cause he he like doesn't want any of the fake food anymore. So mm, probably get some mushroom or something and cook it. I said I'm not sure. We'll see, brother. We gonna have to play it by ear, honestly.